My name is Mita, but sometimes I'm Mora. Mita plays with makeup and Mora is a hoarder. Hello. Hi. Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. My name is Mita, and if you are new to my channel, comment down below and say hello. Hi. <laughs> and if you like my content, Miss Thing, don't forget to give that thumbs up or thumbs down. Engagement is engagement, and we invite it all, Miss Thing. Okay? And if you like this video, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and that notification bell so you can get notified every time I upload. And follow me on Snapchat and Instagram, Miss Thing, because I do respond to messages. Okay? Okay, let's get right into this video, Miss Thing. Whew. So you guys know I have the shalazy and I cannot put on makeup so I have to find other content for you guys. So I wasn't sure if you guys would like this video but I wanted to do it anyway just to see who likes it, who doesn't. We'll find out. I guess I will put a poll here and you guys can let me know if you like these types of videos. I am doing a closet declutter, okay? I will be getting rid of some stuff. Most, for the most part, I will just be reorganizing my closet, taking out my studio equipment because I am currently um renovating a studio for myself for a youtube studio so there will be a whole new uh background i will be having backdrops which look more clean more nice um but some story times probably will be in my room because i just want to kick it with you guys in my room you feel me you feel me okay so guys uh another thing i wanted to ask you guys comment down below and let me know if you want to see a video solely on my bathing suit collection because I do have a bathing suit collection, so let me know if that's something you're interested in, okay? So let's get into this video, guys. Uh, let's declutter my closet. Oh my God, guys. My closet is so decluttered. Let me show y'all. I literally have bags falling out when I open the door. So let's get, ooh! Let's get into um, this closet declutter. I'm trying to stay in frame as best as I can. This is my viewfinder TV for my new studio. We are currently in my new studio, guys. Excuse the belly. I'm on a weight loss journey. Okay? Okay. All right. So let's get into this <sighs> closet declutter. So I have this bag here that has clothes in it. Let me go get a Marshalls bag so I can put stuff that I'm going to donate in that bag. I'll be right back. I have a Marshalls bag. Now, guys, I tend to keep a lot of clothes in hopes that I will lose weight. <sighs> but uh, I know I am going to lose weight, but I should be decluttering most of it, honestly. So I'm going to put a Marshalls bag right here of all the stuff I will be donating or giving to friends and family. Whatever friends and family don't want it, I usually just donate. My sister law gives to the church, so. Okay. So, I have these white sweats. I'm going to keep these. I like how these look with a bodysuit. I got these a lot less for like $3, but with a bodysuit, it really um, conceals the tummy, and they just look great on me. Um, I'm not going to take everything out, guys, because if not, we, this will be like a 10-hour long video, okay? So whatever I know I'm keeping, I'm going to just put to the side. Now, this I have had forever since I bought it, and I have never worn this. I think I wore it one time. It's so nice. It's like an over-the-shoulder sweater. It goes like this for the winter for when you wear, um... You know, when you wear tank tops or whatever, you have something to keep you warm. I almost, I, I think I wore this one time, guys. I'm gonna keep it for this winter, and then after the winter, if I don't wear this, I'm going to declutter it. But I'm gonna give it one more go. I have these cute little shorts. I'm keeping these. Um, are you guys too far? I feel like you guys are too far. Let me move you up a bit. So you guys see a little bit of my studio. Oh, what I'm doing with my studio. Okay. So now, 
I have dresses that my mother-in-law gave me. I tried them on. I did like them. This dress was really, really pretty. I'm gonna keep this, however, I think I'm gonna hang it up because it's really pretty. So I'm gonna just put it there so I can hang it up. I have these long pants that I wear in the summer, but I think they ran their course. I'm gonna get rid of them. These are capris that I love keeping those. Another pair of capris I love keeping those. This is another dress my mother-in-law gave me. Very pretty. Keeping that, I'm gonna hang that up. Um, this is a jumpsuit my mother-in-law gave me for the summer. Keeping this, gonna hang this up. You know, this jumpsuit will look really nice with this sweater over it. Yes, I think I'm gonna put that aside for like my next going out outfit. I think that's what I'm gonna wear. That jumpsuit with that sweater. So I can really utilize the sweater, right? And then I have capri pants here from Old Navy. Um, I'm gonna keep these. However, guys, I am on a weight loss journey, so if I lose weight, I will have to declutter a lot more. And if you guys wanna see that video, just let me know. I have the same ones in red. These are from Old Navy. These are the pixie pants. For anyone who's overweight, even skinny people, they look really nice, guys, and they stretch. And these look so nice on my booty because they're high-waisted, so they come in in the waist, and they look really good. So I'm going to keep these. I have the same pair in, like, a checker pattern. Keeping those. Let's see what else we got here. Now, I have this shirt that I originally, I thought it was cute, but... I'm not crazy about it, guys. I'm going to let that go. I'm going to declutter that. And that's fairly new, too. Oh, I worry. I really worry. Now, this I am keeping for interviews and stuff like that. I like to have interview clothing. Again, I'm losing weight. So, if I lose the weight and it no longer fits, I will declutter it. I don't really know anyone who's heavy like me right now. So, I think I'll just give it to the church. Now, these are some new hoodies I just bought. They have 50% off sale in Old Navy, and I just bought these. So I'm going to take these out so that I can utilize them. Then here, I just have some thermals, some black thermals that I really do enjoy. And they keep me warm during the winter. These are all winter clothes, so I really need to take this stuff out. Um, these are jeans. Old Navy jeans. These are all black. I think I bought like two or three of these. These are all winter stuff. I got another pair in like a navy blue that I bought. Um, another pair in a darker blue. And another pair of black. Now these I think belong in my drawer. And maybe what I have in my drawer I should take out. Because, yeah. So, I'll do that afterwards. So, all this stuff I'm going to take out of the closet, okay? So, let's go in my closet and see what else I have. Now, here I have my makeup traveling case. For those of you who don't know about this, it's really nice. I love this traveling case. This is the extra large one. It had came with a mirror, but the mirror broke when I traveled to Florida. It has a opening here for your brushes and then a top layer so you can put hot tools and stuff. And it also has a strap that you can put this and wear it as a backpack. So yeah, definitely keeping this. This came in handy when I went to Florida. However, I didn't wear half the freaking shit that I bring in this case, guys. No, seriously. So that will go definitely back in the closet. Um, this is a lunch bag that I bought. And it's really nice. It opens here in the middle. And both of these things, guys, I bought on Amazon. So you can just search on Amazon lunchbox and you can search uh, makeup storage or makeup traveling bag. And then it has another zipper up here. This thing is really cool. Definitely going to um, keep this for those summer days or especially now because I'm on a diet if I go somewhere I could meal prep 
I put it in here. Oh god. I think that's what I put now. It's because I got it all bended up in there. So that's definitely going back in the closet. Now here, I have my Michael Kors coat that I bought. Now this coat is good for like fall going into winter, but once it's winter sis, I can't fit a sweater in this. So I'm going to keep it because it's in mint, pristine condition, and it is my go-to fall jacket. Now here, I have some slacks that I bought, as you can see. However, I do not like these slacks, so I will be getting rid of them. I just bought these, and like I really, really, I don't like them. They're just way too stretchy. So I'll be getting in the middle. Now here we have a sowata. And I will be getting rid of this sweater. I don't wear it much. I always like to keep an extra sweater for friends and family when they come over if they get cold. I'm just very thoughtful like that. So I try to keep like a backup sweater, so I think I'm gonna keep it just as a backup in case anyone comes and it rains or it's cold. I always like to have backups for my friends and my family. So I have all these hangers and just pull them out to see what's going on here. So we have some jeans here. Now these are my summer jeans. These are the jeans that I wear in the summer. They have like rips and tears in them, so we're gonna keep that in my closet for storage. Now here I have this kind of work blouse for the office. You can wear a nice little tank top underneath. This I will be keeping. I have kind of like a clothes rack here, so I'm just gonna put stuff on the clothes rack as I take it out, because I wanna completely, I wanna take most of the stuff out. Like my sneakers, I'm not gonna take out because they're already stacked nicely in the closet. They have a nice home. So those I don't really have to take out. Then I have this shirt, which a button popped off of it and I have to replace the button. I forgot where I put the button, but this is so cute. And I got this for work when I get a new job. Um, this is my go-to business suit on interviews. As you can see here, it has the uh, bow and the shirt, and then there's the skirt underneath. So I am keeping that. Recently, I had a job, guys. I will do a story time on what happened and why I'm no longer working. Um, so I will let you know that. This is a sweater, and I will be getting rid of this. I really don't wear this like at all. And have a new sweater that I bought that I really, really like, so. Now I have this um, Vans bag. So let's see what's in here, guys. Oh my God, I have so much stuff. But guys, I really have to declutter this closet, like seriously, because there's so much stuff in here that like I don't use. So this is my hair towel. This should not be in here because I do use my hair towel um, often. Puerto Rican flags. Um, my summer bathing suit. I don't know why this is in here. I'll just throw that over there. Um, another summer bathing suit. This my um, mother-in-law bought for me in Florida. The last time I went, it looked so pretty on me. She got it for me in a bigger size. Um, this is my other bathing suit. Now this bathing suit I altered. Um, this bathing suit originally went straight over the shoulder. I made it a halter top to give me more support on my bust. I also added a old Victoria's Secret bra that I had that had um, some um, cool padding here because you know most of the times we go to the beach we sweat a lot I don't know about you guys but I'm a 38d and um, no I think now I'm a 40d and 
my brows sweat a lot so i need some type of cooling gel under there also this also helps to um keep them puppies nice and tight so you don't got to worry about them falling out of your bathing suit and i love that so what i did was i just sewed it into the lining of the bathing suit and i love this bathing suit but i definitely have to customize that bathing suit now i have all these hair wraps this one i'm going to get rid of i will keep that one i don't really use these anymore i'll keep the black one i used to use them a lot but not anymore the red one i won't get rid of these are my tank tops um i love those for the summer these tank tops are really nice they like stretch and they're like this kind of nylon material i don't know but i love them because they keep everything tight keep the gut the tummy nice and tucked and it's just like my go-to uh thing this is a jumpsuit uh i can't really open it and show you guys because it has a whole bunch of strings so you're not really going to be able to see it i have some underwear here that is really old um another bathing suit this i bought in target about two years ago it's really cute just fun and colorful you know us plus size girls it's hard to find um fun colorful bathing suits so i struggle sometimes um this is a, a two-piece bathing suit and here's the shorts i will be keeping this i usually keep all my bathing suits guys I like to have variety, and then this is the top. I'm keeping this scarf. Another hair towel that I'm gonna take out. <laughs> oh, God bless me. I have some gym clothing here that I'm going to take out because I have started working out again. Oh, my jeans fell on the floor. So I'm gonna take these gym clothes out. <laughs> I will be using those and then my summer jeans I have to find somewhere to put I'll just throw them back there um these are little shorts I like to wear under my dresses if I see that my thighs are rubbing too much I'll throw on a pair of these shorts but honestly haven't done that in a long time guys I'm just gonna get rid of them stop hanging on to stuff that I don't need this is a headscarf I don't really use it anymore. I used to, but I don't use it anymore. Getting rid of it. Really, really don't want to keep things that like I don't use. Bonnet, another hair scarf like that. Getting rid of it. Here's another um, red whole piece bathing suit that I love red in the summer. I love to throw on some red lipstick and just give la cosa. You know what I'm saying? And I'm sorry that that glare, if you can see the glare on the screen, I'm so sorry about that. That's from the light. The light is glaring. Um, I have some more tank tops like that blue one that I love. Some more hair towels that I will be taking out because I do use those. And pretty much another uh, orange bathing suit, but that only has the top piece, so I'm not going to show that to you. If I run into both pieces and I will show it to you okay so everything else in here is just tank top so now what I'm gonna proceed to do is just put inside everything that I'm keeping my tank tops um these head scarves um my summer jeans have to go away those and my bathing suits I will be keeping I usually have another spot for my bathing suits um that must be full if I put the bathing suits in here if I see it's not full then I'll just go back in this bag and um get those um I also also have some summer clothes here that I want to keep so I'll just be putting those in here as well So, as you can see, we have one full bag that's going back in the closet. What's next? What I'm going to do is hang up these hangers on the bottom of this rack so that I have a place to put them. Okay, here we go. 
We have studio equipment. Here is my hair light. Um, if you guys would like me to do a video when I'm done with my studio, you know what? I am gonna do a video. What am I talking about? I'm gonna show you guys the after of my studio. Um, here's more studio equipment. Um, orange backdrop, pink backdrop. Let me put this over here. <clears throat> this is just all my studio equipment. And I just have some backdrops here. Um, this is my face and hair steamer. I should have had this out so I could utilize it more because I don't. This uh, is my polymer clay kit. I just have a whole bunch of polymer clay in there to do projects. I don't know. Um, this is extra stuff for Julie's house, uh, kind of like some, if I need to repair the kit or whatever, I have everything that I need here. So, keeping that, let's see what else we have here. Um, I have a dress that I will be keeping. I do have the same dress in red that I will be keeping. I have these pants that I have never worn. I'm going to take them off the window and put them with that gray outfit so that I can see if I could wear that. This shirt I have hung on to guys because it is so pretty for the summer with a nice pair of white jeans. It is just so flowy and so pretty. But I'm like, dude, I never wear this. I'm gonna give it one more summer. And if I don't wear it, she's gotta go. I have this short sweater, kind of like a crop top sweater. I love that sweater. That sweater is not going anywhere. I've had it for years. Um, I think this is my new, is this my new sweater? I'm not sure if this is my new sweater, but keeping that. This is my workout sweater. Keeping that. And then I have another sweater. Keeping that as well. So here is Coolio. Keeping him. So now we have another sweater here. Does this sort of fit me or what? So, this sweater is a little small on me, but again, I like to keep sweaters for other people. So, what I will do is I will put that with the other sweater in case someone comes to my house. And they're cold. I have this skirt that I'm keeping. But I mean, it is winter, so let's put that away. What are the odds that I'll be wearing that for the winter? Here we have some material backdrops that, uh... Hmm. I don't know. Maybe I should keep them at the edge of the closet towards the back so that I can see them. More hangers, some stuffed animals that I need to utilize somehow, some way. I don't know. <sighs> this is exhausting, guys. More hangers. kind of thinking to myself. These are slacks, but these are so nice, but they don't fit, but I am losing weight and I want to keep them because I don't have any slacks. And I got rid of the other ones, but these are like excellent, excellent quality. So I really, really want to keep those. And I am on a weight loss journey, so. This is my Steve Madden book bag. I love this book bag. I am keeping 
this. We have some, um, I have a leg brace in here that I can just put in here. And the Steve Madden book bag came with like a little wallet. I got this in Marshalls for only $40. I was so happy to get this. It is currently my only backpack. This is a book bag that I have also. It is in good condition. I will be keeping that. Okay, let's see. These back here are all dresses, a jacket, a sweater. Um, I have some like work shoes, nothing, honestly nothing important to look at. Um, trying to see if, there, if I have to take this out or could I just leave it there because I'm gonna show you guys now. So these are kind of like my scarves and wraparounds. I'm going to add the scarf to there and just start utilizing them. I mean, if I have them, right? So let me just bring you guys so I can show you what I mean. Um, as you guys can see, I have like all these clothes over here, sweater, dresses, backdrops, so. I'm just gonna take everything out, guys. I'm just gonna take it out. I'm just gonna take everything out. So this is like my Marilyn Monroe dress. It is so flowy and like so pretty. I'm going to keep this, um, even though I haven't worn that in like, it's been like three, three years since I won that dress. I have my graduation dress and my prom dress from college. I keep that in case I go to a wedding, sweet 16. Next, guys. So, yeah, I keep those dresses in case I go to a wedding, sweet 16, things like that. I have this dress, and I could never get rid of this dress. This dress reminds me of this great memories from when I was a teenager. That's how long I've had this dress. Next, I have this pants jumpsuit that I will bring to the front because I usually wear this in the winter because the material is so thick. I do wear this in the winter. And then this here is a jacket. I call this my Michael Jackson jacket. This is so cute. And I definitely have to lose more weight to wear this. But hopefully I'll get there. Honestly, guys, I'm going to declutter again in the summer. And if I don't lose weight and I don't fit these clothing, I'm going to declutter them. I will do a video showing you and everything. So, four empty hangers, and then we have this sweater that I absolutely love this sweater. It is so comfortable. I got this at Rainbows. Then I have this bright ass sweater that I love. It is so bright, and I do wear it. It has a stain though, so I think I'm gonna put this in the laundry. It has a stain right there. I'm gonna put some shout and put it in the laundry. And if that stain doesn't come out, I will be getting rid of it. I will donate it. But I do not want a giant stain on my chest. Ooh. Here comes a jacket. This is another nice fall jacket. I have to lose a little bit of weight though because it's a little tight on me. But it's a good jacket. What's in this pocket? Oh, I have a lock in my pocket. Here we go. Here is a jacket. 
Um, I have this bag that has my knife collection. I collect knives. I think they're cute. Um, next, we have this suit. This is a pants and a bottom suit. Um, I think I will not be wearing this anymore. I think I know someone who will really, really enjoy this suit. I think my friend, and it's brand new guys with tags. I think my friend Chi Chi will really like this. So I'm gonna give this to her. I already have a bag for her here. Guys, literally every time she comes, she leaves with a bag of stuff. <laughs> she gets mad at me because I'm always giving her stuff. Okay. She comes empty handed and she has to leave here with my bags. It's a habit. But yeah, I have like a whole bag of stuff for her. I always think about her and I always uh, put stuff away for her for when I see her. Okay, so next, uh, I have this sweater dress that I love polka dots, guys, and look at how flowy this sweater dress is. I mean, too cute. Too freaking cute. And then I have this, another kind of winter sweater dress. I think this is more, more fallish, uh, but you can rock this in the, in the winter kind of that material that kind of a little heavy material now this is one of my favorites guys and this is another reason I'm decluttering my closet so I could bring all my winter stuff up so that I can start wearing my winter stuff um, this is a sweater dress red sweater dress I love these they are so comfortable guys you have no idea <coughs> Here I have more fabric backdrops. These are green screens, pink, blue, black. I will be keeping these all the way in the back so that I have easy access to them if I need them. If I need them, I can just open up my closet and boom, they're right at the edge. Uh, next, I have my North Face coat. Guys, I haven't worn this in so long. I don't even think it fits me. This thing is pretty much brand new. I took it to the cleaners. I got it clean last winter. And then I just locked her up and threw away the key. This coat was like $600 when my husband first bought it for me. Ugh. This thing is tight. Ugh. Yeah, this thing... It's too tight. It is very, I mean, it fits, and I can lose in the buckle. I don't know. It does fit, but really tight. Like, you can still see the bottom of my belly, and I hate that. Um, but it is nice. I'm going to keep this, only because it was so much money, and it really is a great coat. And I know if I, for this coat, I don't have to lose like a drastic amount of weight. You know what I mean? If I lose like a little bit of weight, this coat will fit me just fine. So, not bothered, honey. Not bothered in this thing. Guys, I'm really sorry if this light is annoying you guys. It's just, unfortunately, the light is right next to my closet. I do have the vanity lights. Um, but I think those would be too bright. Let's see. Well, we don't have that glare in the camera anymore, so it's just over there. So, hopefully it doesn't bother you guys too much. As opposed to the glare we had actually in the camera. So now, here is my ring lights. More studio equipment. Um... I have this bag here. What's in here? Let's see. These are bathing suits and lingerie. If you'd like me to do a video on bathing suits and lingerie, let me know. I have a ton of them. I have more, so I have a ton of lingerie. Now here is a weekender bag. I will just keep this aside 
in case I need a bag for storage. Okay, so we have coats. Now that my rack is empty, I'm going to start putting stuff. Now down here, I just have a hair dryer, more studio equipment. Um, but I just have a hair dryer, a stand-up hair dryer. Uh, what is that? I have this boot, which I threw the other one out, so I'm going to throw out that one. And I don't know what this is. What is this? This is an asthma machine. Should not be down there. No. I'm going to take these straps off because. Oh my god, guys, I'm working up a sweat, seriously. Decluttering is no joke, especially your closet. Ugh. I'm gonna put the shots inside so they don't get caught to nothing in my closet. And that way, whenever I need a lunch bag, oh, I have one. So, I mean, we're still looking messy, but I got all my studio equipment out and I need it for the studio setup. So, I mean, I got that out the way, right? Now, my backpack, I will be putting it right in front of the backdrop bag just so it's easily accessible um what else we got going on here uh my asthma machine should be in reach so i will be putting that also in reach and now we're going to start putting stuff back in so the jackets and the coats i'm going to be putting in first because these are the least likely i am to reach for simply because we're in winter and i already have my winter coat so, and the dresses, let's see, any more coats? I have a coat here. So I didn't get rid of a lot of clothes. I also have two bags of clothes up there and a suitcase, two suitcases full of summer clothes from when I was thinner, but they're just such nice clothes. I don't wanna get rid of them. So let's see guys, if this summer, I don't fit into those clothes. We will be we will be doing a summer clothes declutter, and I have so many summer clothes. So, okay, let's see here. Okay, so what I will be doing is I will be putting all my sweaters to the back unless I need them. Um, unless I need them, my business attire, I will be putting towards the back, jackets, all that stuff to the back, unless I need it, because those are on a need basis. Um, I'm going to hang up these extra sweaters that I have. And how I know that they are for extra use, I will tie a bow around the neck of the sweater with the sweater string. And that's how I know that these are the sweaters that are for company and they don't fit me. And that's how I'll differentiate which sweaters are which. And I think I also have a sweater over there that's really, really soft. You know that. Okay, so this one doesn't have a bow, so I'm just gonna tie the arms. And that way I know this sweater doesn't fit me. That's a sweater I can get away. Um, now I'm going to get my sweater dresses. Well, first I'm going to get my dresses. That's my mother-in-law gave me. This pretty red one. I'm telling you. They look different on the hanger than the way they look on me. They look so fitted and so beautiful.
Okay. And now my long comfy sweater dresses. Um, this shirt, which should just go back there somewhere because that's a summer shirt. My uh, stars and oh, my jumpsuit, my black jumpsuit should go before my scarves. Black jumpsuit. What else do we have here? Let's see. Um, my jeans. I think I'll hang up my jeans because I don't have a lot of space in my my drawers. So I'll just hang up my jeans here. It's my winter jeans. Just to give space to my drawers because I really have no space in my drawers. So if I need jeans, I can just come here and go in my closet and go I need jeans. So I really didn't get rid of much. I mainly tried to organize. I did so-so. A uh, majority of the stuff in there, guys, is clothes. Seriously. Like, I have this thing with clothes. I don't know how to let go of, like, if I gain weight, I don't know how to let go of my, my skin and clothing. They're so cute and they're so nice. And it's like, it's like I want to lose the weight. Like, I'll get there, you know? Hopefully now, being on my weight loss journey, guys, I'll get there. You know what I'm saying? That's all I can hope for, really. I got these sweaters too. I gotta hang these up so that I can wear them. Cause if I don't hang them up, I won't ever wear these sweaters. Of all these sweaters and my jeans. And now I'm just gonna hang up my sweaters. My thermals, I'm not gonna hang up. My sweaters, I will. outfit that I put together with you guys on camera. So you see how it is? And then it has like a cute bow tie in the front. And then I'm going to wear it with this. So I'm just going to put this around like this. And boom. Like I have an outfit. going in my drawer, drawer, these are slacks that I know I will wear again, skirts that I know I will wear again, um, oh, this sucks, I'm going to take this Victoria's Secret bag, and, um, or you know what, no, I'm going to take these clothes and just stick them in a the corner right here. For now, just for now, um, and then these pants, I'm going to put them on hangers because I'm gonna try to wear them this winter. Wear those going outside. They're a nice pair of pants. So I have a nice amount of pants for this winter, but a really nice amount. And that's because I had started a job and I wanted to make sure that I had variety of stuff. Um, I need a hanger, so I'm gonna use, oh no, I can't use this one. Well, what I can do is I can hang up the sweater on this one. that one for the jeans because I have no more hangers. Well, I had a lot of empty hangers, so this is good because 
being that I put up all this winter stuff, I think I will utilize it now, you know? Because I'm more likely to put on what I can see than what's tucked away in the bags and stuff, you know? So I think I'm gonna get a lot of use out of my winter clothes now. That they're all like there and I can see them. So you see? Like they're all here, you know, my sweaters, sweater dresses, dresses, and then so forth back there. That's what I hate about my closet. You see how it goes all the way back there? Like, how the hell? Like, what the hell, girl? Look at this. Look at how far I got to go back there. It's retarded. So you see this bag here? There's another bag in the back there. And those are full of clothes. Those are like summer shit. So when the summer comes, guys, I'm going to show you. Like, And then these are all like sneakers and stuff. They go all the way to the top. Bags, train case. <sighs> Girl, I'm out of breath. Like, you believe this? And then this is everything I'm going to donate. It's not much, but I also have another bag of stuff that I'm giving to my friend, Chi Chi. Oh, guys, I'm so exhausted. And I think I'm going to give this bag away. I'm not sure, but I think I will be giving this bag away. A cute little bag. It's a Victoria's Secret bag. But I think I'm going to be giving that away. I think my days with this bag are over. and you're not going to believe what happened today. My laptop is not turning on, guys. I think the battery is dead, but even when I take the battery out and I try to plug in my laptop, it doesn't work, sis. It does not work. So I am, I did go to school for uh, computer science and I do know how to take apart laptops. I'm going to take it apart, uh, unplug everything, disconnect everything inside, re-plug it and see if I can troubleshoot it and find out what the hell's going on with my laptop because that's how I finish editing my YouTube videos so I don't know what I'm gonna do now oh, don't know what I'm gonna do now but that's that guys that's pretty much it for this video stay tuned guys so you guys can see my new studio I have more pieces coming in this week so I should have that video up for you guys by next week Monday or Tuesday or Wednesday so Monday through Wednesday next week should be my new studio uh, video. Um, also, I think that week is gonna be all um, YouTube Creator Week, so look forward to that. Next week, I will be doing how I edit my videos, how I upload, and all that jazz. So that will be all techie stuff is gonna be happening next week. A lot of you DM me um, who are just sending out in YouTube and asking me all these questions, and I wanna help you guys out, okay? So uh, I will be getting in depth into all of that, okay? So guys, that is it for this video. I love you guys so, so much. And I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys.